This is an illustration to show you how to find roots of complex number. In this case, we are going to find all the solution of z cubed equal to minus 8. Now what we do is express the number minus 8 in two exponential form. This is now you note that minus 8 is 8 times e power i pi. Why is that so? If you recall that e power i theta is located at a point where the argument from x axis, the argument is theta, and the distance from origin is 1. So, what is e power i pi now? Is e power i pi the number is actually minus 1 because what is pi, the angle pi will be here, 180 degree. So e power i pi will be this point where this is 1 from the origin, which is, that's why the point is minus 1. So 8 times minus 1, you get minus 8, come out. And we know that e power i 2 m pi is equal to 1 because 2 m pi for any integer m is a multiple of 2 pi and 2 pi means 360 degree. This number, you know that e power i 2 m pi is 1 because the moment you draw the angle 2 pi, argument 2 pi, you find that the complex number is located at the point z equal to 1. That is why e power i pi times e power i 2 m pi times 8 is equal to minus 8 now. But if you say that, then you'll be able to find all the cube root of z now because e power i pi times e power i 2 m pi is equal to e power i pi plus 2 m pi now. And then taking the cube root, both sides is z equal to 8 power 1 third times e power i pi plus 2 m pi and then we raise the power 1 third for the indices. So you find that this is i times 2m plus 1 pi over 3 now. For 8 power 1 third we know is 2. So z equal to 2 times e power i 2m plus 1 over 3 pi. So you can put the value of m equal to 0, 1, and 2. You will get all the solutions. Now it is not necessary to put m equal to 3, 4, and 5 because the solution will just repeat. This is the illustration. Note that for m equal to 3 you have 2 times 3 plus 1 which is 7, so you get z equal e power i 7 over 3 pi, which is equal to 2 times e i 1 third pi times e power 6 over 3 pi i. But then 6 over 3 is 2, so you get e power i 2 pi, and e power i 2 pi is 1. So eventually, you will get z equal to 2 times e power i times 1 third pi, which is the same value when you put m equal to 0. That is why the value of z repeat. It's not necessary to put m equal to 3, 4, 5, 6, and so on. You just need to put m equal to 0, 1, 2.